Hi, this is Alan with Tex Nation TV, still on day one, CES 2014, covering uh, one million square feet, one booth at a time. So of that a million square feet, we ran across th this place, BitPay. And we've been following Bitcoin since its in inception. And like everyone else, we were like, uh, virtual currency, it's not going anywhere. Then I saw the Winklevoss twins bought a bunch of it, and so I started to take notice. Still didn't buy into it. And this time last year, January, Bitcoin was trading at $13. Still didn't buy on it because of everybody saying, eh, it's not going anywhere. I think right now it's at about $900, so foot in mouth right here. But I'm here with Tony J Gallippi. Tony Gallippi. Yeah. Here, the man in charge. And uh, I'm going to let him answer all the questions we have here. So tell us all about uh, BitPay. So BitPay is a really important part of the Bitcoin ecosystem. Uh, BitPay has the tools to make it easy for businesses to accept Bitcoin as a form of payment. It doesn't work anything like credit cards or PayPal, so none of the existing software and payment gateways out there will work for Bitcoin. They need all new software. So we saw that need about three years ago in early 2011. We started our company and we started building the software tools for businesses. Uh, the value proposition for them was pretty clear. Mm -hmm. You can take a payment irreversibly from anywhere in the world for very little cost. It's a lower risk and lower cost form of payment than anything else they're taking on their website today. And it also reaches a lot more of the world. They just didn't have the tools for it. And so uh, today here we're uh, approaching 20,000 merchants on board with us. Uh, some big names like WordPress, Zynga, and a few others nice. uh, are using BitPay to accept Bitcoin. Nice, any uh, brick and mortar businesses starting to take hold as well? Yeah, we do actually. We have a Lamborghini dealer in Newport Beach. So if you want to go shopping around for a car uh, and you got some Bitcoins burning a hole in your pocket, you can drive up to the Newport Beach Lamborghini and, and, and drive away with a car. Well, with Bitcoins being so popular, you may be able to get a few under value of a Lamborghini just because they want those Bitcoins kind of like gold. Sure. So you may be able to get a Gallardo with a, a couple of Bitcoins, you know? Yeah. Nice. Uh, actually, in Nashville, Tennessee, where we're from, we have a restaurant called Flight, and they're now accepting Bitcoin as purchase for meals. Mm -hmm. So right now, like a lot of people are starting to take a look at this a little more closely. Like we were talking about earlier, the skepticism is starting to go away and actually seeing money being generated. So is BitPay like a wallet as well for the individual? Like not just business, can individual uh, users uh, get involved with that as well? Uh, no, BitPay is compatible with all the wallets that a consumer would use, whether it's on Android or iPhone or on their computer. Uh, but we're just a merchant service. So think of us okay. as like the first data for Bitcoin. Gotcha. Um, you know, and you know, in it, because Bitcoin is cloud-based, any phone or tablet or iPad can be a point of sale, and so that's where we're seeing a lot of retail uh, people adopt it. And, and we have a little web app we give to all of our merchants. They can, you know, uh, input a, uh, their information on a screen and take a payment at a cash register or at a table if it's a restaurant. Uh, works really well. Nice. So it's like a like a PayPal button on a, a website. Works like that. You can yeah. just hit your um, BitPay radio button or whatever it is, and then they're, they're able to accept Bitcoins. Yeah, typically when a customer is shopping on a website, they're filling out their shopping cart of what they want, and the payment is the very last thing. And they're typically presented with multiple options for payment. I can pay with a credit card or PayPal or, or something else. And uh, we give them the ability to add a Bitcoin button, and then that payment will get routed to us, and then we send the merchant uh, the call back when it's done. Nice, uh, tell us how a business would get started with that, uh, getting a hold of you and setting all that up. Well, they would just come to our website, bitpay.com. Uh, there's a big green button on the front to start accepting Bitcoins. And you can literally be have an account approved in a few minutes. And then if you want your limits raised, you know, we have to get some documentation from you. Uh, but then it's just a matter of doing the technical integration work. If you're a developer, you can take our API and, and, uh, and run with it. But if you're using a popular uh, web commerce store like Magento or Shopify, we're integrated with those. So you just install our plugin or enable it and, uh, and you've got BitPay as an option on your checkout. Nice. Uh, what about security? What kind of security measures are in place for uh, your Bitcoin? Well, with Bitcoin, you've got to be really concerned about security. So, you know, the good thing about Bit Pit, BitPay is that we're not a bank. We don't really store a lot of funds. We're a processor. So money comes in and money goes out. So, you know, it's not like we're storing lots of money for people and, and making ourselves a target. Uh, but we, we um, send Bitcoins to exchanges. We trade on all the exchanges. And then we give our merchants the option they can either keep the Bitcoins or we can push out settlement to them in, in dollars or euros. Um, either case, you know, we're pushing the money out to them as quickly as we can um, because it's, the, it's their money, not ours. Nice. Well, Tony, I'd like to thank you for uh, giving us a minute of your time here. I know you got businesses happening all over. Hopefully you get yep. a lot more business during this uh, week. Yep. And be sure to check them out at bitpay.com. Bitpay 
Yeah, we'll get that right. Yeah, uh, bit, BitPay.com and uh, get your business set up. Start accepting Bitcoins. Uh, get out there and uh, make that money. See my man Tony over here. And stay tuned to TextNation.tv for the rest of the CES 2014 coverage.